All right, so you just saw my self-care Sunday morning routine. So typically, this is what I do every single Sunday. Once in a while, I don't get a chance to because our girls have Sunday school. So sometimes by the time I get home, I'm a little exhausted and it ends up being my Sunday nighttime routine, which is the same. I try to keep this routine for at least on Sunday. So you saw first thing I did was I just washed my face, with whatever kind of cleanser I'm using at the moment and then I fell with whatever kind of scrub I'm using at the moment so I ended up using that and then I did I, I did show you what my face masks that I use so first type of face mask that I always use is some kind of detox charcoal mask so currently the one that I'm using is this one from Perlis for the fall I absolutely love using this one for the fall because it smells like pumpkin it's really good and the benefits for your skin are amazing so this is typically my fall one normally when i buy it i have enough just for the fall season and then i go ahead and switch to another mask because i never want to overuse the same mask so my skin doesn't get used to it and then this i just leave on for it's about 10 to 15 minutes i do leave it on for the 15 minutes and then of course you saw i just took it off then after that, I follow with some kind of hydration mask because I know that with me, you know, you take all those gunk out of your face and then I need to put, hydrate it back. So the current one that I'm using is Hey Honey, Show Your Glow. This one is absolutely, absolutely amazing. This one I actually do more so use. That really didn't make sense. I more so use. I actually use this more um, for other seasons, not just for fall. But th this one, once I use it, I switch it with something else. And I'll probably end up going back to this. But this is my absolute, absolute favorite hydration. And then you actually saw that I used it with their brush. This brush that they have. I really, really like this brush by Hey Honey to get, um, to use it for my mask to get all the stuff out. It literally, this right here, at first when I saw it, I was like, oh, this is going to be interesting. But it really does get into anything because I noticed like, I actually really like using brushes more than using my fingers because you don't waste as much of the product. And I just hate rewashing my face and getting all that gunk off because sometimes the mask is a little bit harder um, to get off when it's wet than a composed when it's um, already dry. And this mask, just about 10 minutes, and I do leave it on for 10 minutes. Sometimes with my mask, I do go over. And then you saw I followed it with my toner. And then after that, I used my eye patches. So the one that I uh, was using was this one by Generation Skin. This is their hydration one. This one, I actually use this nine out of 10 times. If, um, cause this also brightens and this also um, depuffs as well. But this one, nine out of 10 times, I will use it. Sometimes I'll use their other eye patches where this one is their green tea one which depuffs it does depuff so when my allergies are really bad in the more uh in the morning on self-care sunday um uh, then i will put this on or if i look a little dull then i will use this one this is their brightening one and sometimes i will not only use if my eyes are a little bit puffy i'll use the puffy one and then i'll also use the brightening one right afterwards back to back so it just really depends how i feel and then I'm not going to lie, I probably leave my eye patches on for at least 30 minutes because I just literally like, I like how I can use these masks and the eye patches and just put them on really fast to do what I need to do in the house and then go ahead and take it off whenever. So then you guys saw the tool that I use. So currently the tool that I'm using um, is a micro needling derma roller. So before I use that, I have been using this serum by Serum Kind. This is their purple cabbage drop. This is for calming and nourishing. So I try to find a serum that calms your skin because this tool right here is actually, it's amazing. I've noticed like my wrinkles in my forehead have gone down. But the thing with this is, they say if you have really sensitive skin, you use it once a month. I use it once a week. And they said even at first to just use it when you first use it, use it once a month. But I literally just started using it once a week. So they have these little, if you can see, it's kind of hard to see. These little micro needling bristles. There we go. And, you know, you just slowly go back and forth about five times per um, line and you just keep going throughout your whole face. I have noticed a huge deal of improvement in my skin. And, but you can completely tell after using this, my, my face for at least half of the day 
feels like I did something to my skin. Not like a reaction, it just feels like needles were on my skin. So that's why I use a calming serum, like the one that I just showed you, because I have felt that um, it has been helping a lot better. Then after I use that tool, I just follow with my regular serums and my eye creams and my face lotion. And then normally, if I am doing self-care Sunday on the morning, which it's normally nine out of 10 times in the morning, I really don't put on any makeup besides mascara. If I know I'm going out, I'll just put on a BB cream or more shortly at the time it's a CC cream because I it is my face might be a little bit red from the needling, but I normally just try to give my face a break with the makeup and just do some mascara. But that is everything for my self-care Sunday. All right, and so what I'm gonna talk about with you guys, I'm not gonna show you guys because it actually is for body care. I wanted to show you or talk to you about some of the products that I use for my body. So once a week I use a scrub and a moisturizer, but every single day I use some serums. So I wanted to actually show you guys just the serums because this is something I do every single morning. So I have been using these products by Truly. You guys have probably heard me talk about them before. I love their products and I have seen a huge difference. So first one I'm going to talk about is this one right here, Dolce de Leches. So this is their serum. This is for your boobs and your belly. So I actually put it on my chest and I put it on my belly every morning. And then once a week on Self Care Sunday, I will use the scrub and then I will follow by the moisturizer and then follow by the serum. So I do that um, every day, just the serums and then the three of them on Self Care Sunday. And then I use this one. It's called Cake Maker. This is their serum. This is actually for your legs and your butt. Now, I don't actually use this one on my butt every day because I have a different serum. But this one I use every day on my legs. And then on Self Care Sunday for their scrub and their moisturizer, I actually use that on my butt and my legs. I have seen a difference in these products. My skin has been looking a little bit smoother. I just noticed I don't feel as like, like icky throughout the day when I use, especially like the Self Care Sunny, the once a week, those products. I feel like, I don't know, I just, it, they make me feel like I'm clean like all day. Like I, you know, shower like 15 times a day. But I just, these products are absolutely amazing. And then my favorite one by them, and I have completely noticed a difference in a week like this these are amazing this is their anti-cellulite cream this is why i don't use the other one on my butt i actually use this one on my butt and it's also good for stretch marks too so i actually will put them on my stretch marks i have noticed that my stretch marks are smoother than they used to be they're not completely gone but they are smoother but i have noticed my cellulite is pretty much gone so i will use this every single morning and then on self-care Sunday I actually will like I said use the cake maker scrub and the moisturizer but I actually also use their cellulite lotion that kind of goes in their package followed by the serum so uh, I use all these and then actually down below I have a coupon code for you guys if you want to check them out what I actually really love about um their products too is they're not that expensive they have tons of packages um and also, not only if you know using my coupon code, you will get a discount. They always have free gifts. So if, sometimes, if you spend like a hundred bucks, you get like a free body scrub or a free lotion. So sign up for their emails and check them out. But that's everything I use for my body.
my nighttime routine. So once a week, most of the time it's on Wednesdays because that seems to be like the early night after I get the kids to bed. As you saw in my nighttime fall routine, if I don't do this, as soon as the kids go down for bed, I never do this. So kind of do a little self care in the evenings once a week. So what I do first is I first take off all my makeup. I try to use one of those um, like little um, cleansing balms. I was kind of looking at it as you saw, like this is the one that I'm currently using right now. So I try to use a cleansing balm or I also use like just those mineral waters just to go ahead and clean off my face with the makeup. And then I follow by washing my face. So whatever current cleanser I'm using, that's the one that I'm washing my face with. And then I use this one by Yensa. So this is their pumpkin turmeric uh, polishing scrub. This is amazing. I love using this at the fall time. I actually a lot of times use this more than just the fall time, but for sure always the fall time. So what this one is, after I wash my face, I put the spouse the polishing scrub on my face and then this you put on for five to ten minutes I really don't go above ten minutes I you know do whatever I need to do really fast and then just take it off my face and then continue on with my products but this one is absolutely amazing just to go ahead and like you know like it says polish up your face for the week so it is it's it's a good product and then I of course follow again with my eye patches so you guys have seen this earlier in the video I normally do the brightening one all the time and then again if my allergies are really bad then I will either use the brightening one that's on the top or the depuffing one that's on the bottom so just follow up with my eye patches and that one I do leave on for a while and I probably will just you know go put them on and then clean the kitchen make sure everything's all settled so I can go ahead and just relax for the rest of the night and then as soon as they're ready to come off, I put my serums on. Of course, I put my, I don't use the same serum that I do in the morning. I actually use a specific one for the nighttime. And then I follow with eye cream. So especially um, at night, I use this one by Yensa. It's their Renewal Eye Cream. It's got pink lotus in there. So I use this at night. And then I follow with their face cream. So I use those products and then right before I go to bed, besides putting like a sleepy time or a lavender lotion, lotion, <laughs> a sleepy time or a lavender essential oil in my diffusers, I always put some kind of overnight lip treatment on. So currently this is one of my favorites. It's Unicorn Fruit by Truly. You can focus. It's so adorable. That's what they little swirls on the inside so I actually just got a new one this is what it actually looks like so but yeah this one has peppermint and matcha really 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 good for your lips so that is everything that I use for my nighttime I try to get as quickly as possible like with self-care Sunday I have more time to do just like pretty much relax with everything on my face but it on Wednesday nights when I normally do my nighttime self-care I like really want to quickly just do a little bit of something but still make sure like I'm actually like self-caring my skin all right so that is everything for my fall self-care routine for my nighttime and for my self-care Sunday I just actually really recently started picking up doing my self-care because our bathroom's been under construction and I'm just like it I have not been motivated to do it, but some ever since fall came back into the picture, it's motivated me to go back into my self-care routine. But I have coupon codes down below for Yensa, Perlis, and for Truly. If you guys want to check them out, comment down below any of these products that you like, love, and want to try. I'd love to hear. And then also, I would love to hear what you guys use for your self-care. And then self-care is not only about using these products i try to make sure i go to bed between 10 30 and 11 at night really relax my husband and i either watch tv i try not to watch too much we really don't watch too much tv but once in a while i like to catch up on our shows mostly like on the weekends but i love to go ahead and read a book at night i'm really trying to get back into reading or just last week i started doing a puzzle at night which was really just stuff that's calm to just like get you into that routine to go to bed at like 10 30 11 but that's another self-care that i do so don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up 
subscribe to my channel, and then I will see you guys in our next one. Bye. Uh -huh.